Um, hello! This is a sketchbook tour. <laughs> I never know how to start these videos, but I'm f I've been finally done with my 13th sketchbook, so I'm gonna tour it on here. Yes. This is gonna be a long, in-depth video where I'm gonna be talking a lot, so you could, like, draw in the meantime or something. Um, <laughs> I don't really know. Okay, let's just get into it. All the stickers on the front are milky, milky tomato stickers. Uh, yeah, if you don't know who milky tomato is, just Google it or something. <laughs> um, the back, that's also milky tomato stickers. These are just some random ones. The, the sketchbook, quickly, the sketchbook is a moleskin sketchbook that I painted pink. Yeah, it is it is black actually. Um, but I don't recommend buying this moleskin sketchbook because it has really thin paper. So if you're gonna draw on a moleskin sketchbook, like use it as sketchbook, buy like one, the art moleskin sketchbook with the thick pages. I accidentally bought a not thick one. <laughs> I don't know. Um, anyways. I'll see if it's in frame. There. Okay. I started this May 13th, 2020, um, 2023, and ended it yesterday, which was 23rd November. The first pages here is just random stuff that I stuck in during, during the time of the, <laughs> during the time of drawing in the sketchbook. We got Here's a little cute collage. Um, and then the, the first thing I drew in the sketchbook was just, I went outside and I drew some geese. Yes, that's right, geese. <laughs> and that's just, these pages are just geese. I really like this one. Um, <laughs> very fun. That one looks like a pelican though. Um, and then we have the first real page. I don't know why I put that in there. Um, which we got. To say with this. This is some oil pastels in the background and a unicorn. Ooh, here I designed um, a clown character. Um, his name is Cards and he can make card tricks. <laughs> and he's also really funny. Just know that. <laughs> oh, okay. Can I. Will I be able to? Here is a landscape painting or something, which is the only, like, <laughs> landscape painting I attempt to do. Yeah. Flower. We're gonna skip this page. That's ugly. Oh, this one I really love. I This might be my favorite drawing in the whole sketchbook. It's very beautiful lady. And this is just me. I drew this, these two drawings from the same reference photo but this one i i looked at the page while i was drawing this one i only looked at the reference photo and didn't look at the page which i i like that one way better than this one a little collage thing there's a flower here just some i don't know what this is actually a clown this is a spider girl and um this is some random character it's not Miku. I wrote that it's not Miku, but it, it really looks like Miku. Uh, yeah, this is just, these are my character Sally. You will see a lot of her. Are they done? Done. Okay, anyways. Um, this is some random face. I really like this. This is a grumpy cat. And this is my stuffed animal, like, sock. My, my, my sock monkey. Got this, this oil pastel painting. And this is like, I drew with some invisible marker on this page. You can almost see the, the marker shining through, which now it isn't invisible anymore or something. But the, the oil pastel is kind of just got on the other page. That's kind of annoying. Okay, here we have... Just like uh, a view, I was out out at the sea, so I drew drew the the landscape or something. I don't know what to say. 
this page is ugly. I like this shirt though. It says, you're ugly. It's like a scene kid. I don't know. Uh, I drew some shoes. My sister had some sandals on. I was like, I can draw those sandals, but it, 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 it did not. Not turn out well from the deformed shoes here. I'm done. I don't think they're done drilling. Oh my god. Why did I do it now? <laughs> it's literally the worst time to do a sketchbook tour. Anyways, this is just random. I think this is Sally, my OC, but I am not sure. It's just some random person. <laughs> Watch the Lego movie. Here's here's uh Lucy or wild style. She's so cool. She was a role model for me when I was younger <laughs> Here's some random faces. I really like this one and and this one <laughs> And underneath is just ugly stuff. That's why I kind of covered it up or whatever And we have It's my birthday. This is the birthday spread. It's kind of some confetti look, look. This was my birthday so, um, I turned 15, uh, and, uh, I went and watched the Spider-Verse movie on my birthday. That was my birthday gift, one of my birthday gifts. And then I just drew Spot when I came home. <laughs> yeah. Great. Can I put this in here again so it doesn't mess up the page on the other side? Oh my god, this is just my little milky tomato collage because I got... I, I ordered some stuff from Milky Tomatoes, so I had to use these little scruffly thingies. Okay. Here we have a, like, a, a color challenge, challenge where I only use three colors. And for some reason, it kind of looks like Will from Stranger, Stranger Things, but I don't know. It's got a vest on. <laughs> then I redesigned some characters I've drawn in the past. We got Molly. And, and Ash and May. Great. And then <laughs> drew this. And at the time, I really hated it because I have massive art block. But I don't think it's that bad that I have had to write ugly beside it. But whatever. Here we got my OC Alex and my OC Sally. Yes. Oof. A this spread might be my favorite spread in the whole sketchbook. They got this face that I wish I had like a reference for, but I just drew it from my brain. So it looks a little funky, but, um, and some weird looking hands. I, I love drawing hands, like really weird. And that's a self portrait of me. Oh, I got, I got Posca pens, which is like, really super cool. I, I got like the biggest pack ever for my birthday with all the colors so that was like so cool. And here are my OCs again, Sal and Alex and I don't know who this is. I don't know. <laughs> oh my god, this page is crazy. Uh, we got Batman up here, his disco ball, my OC Alex. <laughs> my, I don't know who this is. And we got Alex and some Alex and I don't know, Tamagotchi. Ooh, I redesigned my OC s Sad Cat, I think. So, kind of looks like Garfield, which is, I don't know, a little bit annoying, but it's Garfield. <laughs> Ooh, I made, I made like a spider Sona. This was concept art for it. It didn't turn out looking like this because I wanted it to be like a moss spider, but for some reason it more looks like a rose or something with the little spikes. So I made it, I made it look different. And here's just random doodles. I don't really know. I had a, a lot of art block drawing this. I think. Oh, here are some like what is this? Uh, figure studies I did. I think you can fold this out here. They are really bad. It was just me being bored and not knowing what to draw. But I like this guy getting punted in the head. Yep. And this face up here. I'm gonna skip that page, go to this one. Um, fishies? I don't know. A mermaid? Um. 
fishies. Why did I say fishies? That's so weird. This character is like inspired by a wine glass. I don't really know. And um, random letters, face. This is really just gonna be me pointing at things and saying what it is, like random face. Uh, this is um. Not toilet paper, but it's kind of the same thing. Um, old tree. I don't know what it says. Some eyes. Oh, here we. Here was a thing where I asked my friends, give me three animals, or give me an animal, and then I would like mix them together. So we have the fish horse with human legs because they're all. They all have to have human human feet. Oh my god! Look, the sketchbook is falling apart. Here. That is, that's not good. Um, then we got the eel moose with human legs, of course, and uh, the spider bear with human legs. <laughs> and here we have like a little little city, uh, I know, and a clown. And then you gotta look at this leaf. Look at this leaf. I don't know if you can see it, but it it's got a face on it, and I did not draw that face. I found this on the ground with the face on it. It's it's so cool. <laughs> little, little leaf with with face. This is a very random page. Oh, this I had a lot of art block in the beginning of the sketchbook, so a lot of it's just weirdness. Girl being sad, you can see from the cloud, and this is like a. I tried to draw. Was it like a, a a bunny? Easter bunny? But it looks like a kangaroo and I don't know what happened to it. <laughs> Ooh, this page I spent a lot of time on. Very cool. Oh, here we got a dragon baby. A baby and a dragon combined. <laughs> I really like it. <laughs> Very disturbing. Here's what my sister drew this, and this is some fish. My friend's OC, and if you if you fold this out, it says it all ends here for you. And also it says the fun starts here and now, but I said the fun, and, and then I was like the fun ends here and now instead. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I was doing. Oh, we got this page. That girl you want to be. I wanted to draw like um, really aesthetic, like sometimes you see those people on TikTok that are drawing only with pencil and it all looks amazing. So I wanted to try to draw that. I don't really know. I like this one here. I really like that hand. I'm not sure about her. But yeah, I like it. I'm never drawing with pencil again like this because it really smudges. That's why there's a paper here so they don't smudge each other but itself. Um, random girl, random girl. Here is uh, also just a random person and feet because feet are weird, man. <laughs> they look really weird. I know people say that feet are weird, and they really are, and I think that's the best part about them. Like, we should draw more feet, because they just look so stupid. They look like aliens to me. There we got... Mum... Mum May. I don't really know. I was trying to make a cool, like, mummy name, because it's like a mummy character, and I wanted to give him, like, a cool name, but it just sounds like mommy. Mum, mummy, but whatever. I really like them. This one's especially, I like this drawing. My friend did the sketch for this and then I kind of just lined it and colored it for her. <laughs> I really like it. Great art. Here is, I got these headphones and I cut it out from the packaging stuck it in here and then I drew like a person wearing the headphones that was really cool here's my OC Sally just being sad because she always be sad 
Smurf. <laughs> I don't know. She, she's got blue skin. Uh, Smurf energy right there. And then we have Twilight Sparkle. Because she's my favorite. And I was a ginormous MLP fan. And I still kind of am. I, I really love Twilight Sparkle. She, she was my favorite one. Then we have the Eggman. I don't know. Just don't read this if you don't know what it says. I only drew with like really crappy art supplies from the like, Kinder Egg surprise thingies that I found. Um, <laughs> and it looks really bad. <laughs> it, it's really bad. And here um, is a guy on a scooter in Paris. No, in France. I was in France, so I drew this with a, it's a guy. And uh, this is just a random page. And I wrote cat hand. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Ooh, here's a here's a sp another like spider Sona person. I don't know. It's not really a Sona. It's more of a spider OC that I'm not drawing again ever. But it is. It is Ray K the Star Scout, which I think sounds cool because Star Spider has been overused way too much. I feel like there are so many people who have. Uh, spider ocs and or spider sonas and then they named them s something star spider or spider star and i i think that is overused so i tried to use something else than that and i also only used like four colors or something it was this one the brown and that one and then black yeah those four colors so kind of limited there's some uh scott pilgrim art this is ramona ramona and I drew her before the series on Netflix came out because I I read the books while this was here and I was just like I need to draw Ramona she's the coolest character ever uh, so here are like her outfits in the four first volumes or the, how she looked in the four first, first, first volumes I was supposed to do the two last volumes here but then I was like kind of too tired to do that so i just wrote like lol oh <laughs> oh my god we got oliver and charlie i need to draw these guys more but they are so they are so cute they are so cutie patootie i i love them and the fact that they have like the same little color palette like they're only they're like purple turquoise and pink that's like their colors they're so cute Oof. this page this page i was going for the perfect sketchbook kind of page where it's like the sketchbook spread has coherent colors and stickers and stuff yeah, I, I think this is really cute this is also one of my favorite spreads we got this little bunny character Random thing. Oh. Sorry, that was dying. Okay, this might be the best spread in the whole sketchbook. Look, it's so good. It's it's also one of the coherent sketchbook spreads with with colors that match and stuff. I really like this face. Then we got bugs are beautiful. And uh, I drew some bugs. Yeah. Some of the bugs look really weird. I don't really know. I wasn't looking too closely at the at the reference sometimes. <laughs> Especially this one up here is kind of weird. Okay. We're gonna skip this because I decided I wanted to do the 100 heads challenge and gave up at head number 21. I gave up there, so we're just gonna skip that because they're all ugly. Some cards I found on the ground? this face with four eyes because if you don't know what to draw draw a face with more eyes or less eyes than normal got this lady which i mean i like the art style it's interesting and here are some more here are some fish with legs fish with long legs fish with Human hair, hairy human legs. I don't really know. And this horrifying fish down here. You need to just stare it in the eyes. Staring contest. One, two, three, go. 
Have you blinked yet? Have you have you blinked yet? <laughs> I'm just gonna hold it up until you blink. How long is that gonna be? Okay, you know what? You lost. I don't know. Maybe you won. Maybe you won. I'm not sure. Here we got <laughs> very dramatic page. We got um, Char Charlie and Oliver again. Kind of, and then this this face with this mesh. <laughs> it's just we live life to hate it. Da -da -da -da. Very dramatic. Oh my god, uh, that is me. Me, you can tell it's me. That was how I looked at the time. My hair dye is kind of faded, so my hair isn't pink anymore. But uh, and this this pattern over here took so long. It was like, I just kept putting layers on layers on layers. It was very, very random. But I'm happy with the result. It looks, it really looks like a brain juice or something. Oh my god. You need, you need to hear my story. And I'm probably, sh I'm really sure that there are some misspelling on this. But just let me read it for you. I ate dinner this morning. But the fork was not a fork. It was a five because it's got it's, it's got five on it. You can't eat dinner with a five. It was sad. I was looking forward to the peas and the peas are here and yeah. The funny thing is you can't you. I ate dinner this morning. Like you don't eat dinner in the morning. You that was the funny part. I don't really know. <laughs> oh my god! I also did these ones. If life gives you lemons, then why do I have a pineapple? <laughs> the great mystery of, of the world is why seawater is salty. But it's just because fish pee is salty. This one's my favorite. When life is bad, you just have to ask it to be better. Be nice about it though. Life doesn't take critique very well. And that is probably the worst way to spell critique ever, but whatever. Ooh, I was doing a design on my t-shirt. I was gonna sew something on it and I was just figuring out what I wanted to draw on it or make on it. And here's some broccoli with faces. Oh my god. This might be the best drawing I have ever made ever. <laughs> Aliens must be very intelligent. And I know I spelled intelligent wrong, but just give me something. Just give me something to be happy about. <laughs> and, and the funny thing is that the that the alien just does not look like it got any brain cell at all. <laughs> I really like these weird faces here too. Ooh, here is OC Sally, like a, like her when she was younger. We got Alex, and um, I was really wanting to draw my old OC moss again which if you know moss you know moss but here is like me trying to redesign them did not work out but whatever also look at this tape look at it look at how cute it is here we got another OC moss drawing I really like this face too very cute face and bear all right, I was drawing random things. I was just drawing random things. Ooh, I really like these robot thingies. They're like futuristic, weird looking trash robots with TV heads. And here are some, just some oranges and a purple leaf I found on the ground. Oh, this was a challenge where I only had to draw with three, three different markers and I pulled or three different art supplies actually I and then I got purple Posca a pencil and a black marker which was a really annoying pull because you know but I made a clown character and I I, I think I like this this is okay it's fine and then we have these two I really like her expression here I don't know what magic or something I I had in my hands that day, but it really looks good. And then we got this character. They're just random people. I don't know. Ooh, 
Here, I was trying to redesign the way I draw Alex and Sally. So there's just a lot of Sally and Alex doodles all around where I was trying to mix. I wanted to make them like cartoon characters. Like if they were in a cartoon show, what art style would they be? Um, so this is just random. I really like that one and that one of Alex. Just mix, trying stuff. And I really like this face. I wish I used a reference for it, but that is just something that came out of my brain, so. Ooh, here are two girls. I just, just a picture I have, and then I just drew them from the picture. They look really funky. If you want some funky art, try to draw a photo, but instead of looking at the paper, you only look at the photo while you're drawing. With practice, it's gonna look really funky. <laughs> so that's what these are. I just looked at the photo, not the page, while I was drawing. And then they turn out really weird looking. Um, here is like my redesign of Sally, kind of. You can see I liked her having like a pointy nose, like, uh, like Pearl from Steven Universe. <laughs> Still not getting Alex quite right. Did not like the thing I drew here. And that, I just found a Pokemon thing on the ground. And I was like, that's going my sketchbook. And I don't know who this is. Random guy. Here's some more like Alex trying to do stuff, kind of. And also, I have a really weird thing with like spelling Alex and Sally. I have no idea. The L's kind of just come and go. But I have decided now that I'm spelling Alex with two L's and Sally with one. And that is how it's gonna be and that is just hopefully gonna stay that way and I'm not gonna mix it up anymore. And I know that Alex is actually spelled with one L. I just want to be different and I want him to have a different name than normal. And Alex is kind of a very basic name so I wanted to make it look uh, not basic. And here are Alex's Redesign and Sally's redesign. I really like them. <laughs> They're very cute. And Alex is just like a little tiny boy with a ginormous coat that is just way too big for him. Um, and Alex, no, Sally is just, <laughs> I don't know. Sally is just always nervous and anxious. This is just like an old paint palette I've had for a long time, so I just stuck it in there. It's really nice because there's just years of paint stacked onto this. That's just oil pastel for face, yeah. Oh, I did this really funny thing with my with my face. Um, or if you take a picture of yourself and then make a grid on it. I made a grid that was one, two, three, four, five equal squares, squares down and then three equal squares, like, and then Afterwards, you you draw the, like um, a square in your sketchbook, but instead of making all the squares the same size, you try to make them weird looking. And then afterwards, you look at the photo. <laughs> this is a really weird explanation, but you look at the photo and then you draw what is in that specific square in the square, and then it's gonna look really stupid and weird, like. <laughs> <laughs> These ones. This one's my favorite. This one's so goofy looking. And then we have this one too. That's one. This one's also very, very goofy looking. This is a weird picture from Pinterest. With a guy with two like fishy fish, like on his eyes. Very funny looking. Ooh, here we have just some random stuff. I really like this random art style I just came up with while drawing this character. She's like, Urgh! she's like, don't look at me, I'm angry. Ah! <laughs> oh my god, this page is very, very random. But we got my my moss guys. Do you remember Corey, Polly, uh, Star, and Spoon? They're very cute. I like the doodle of Spoon. And this little thing, this little scene I made, you'll get a scene tour because this is gonna be a, a very full sketchbook tour, okay? <laughs> very long one. Uh, it's also very random, but whatever. This is a girl in the shoe. This is a, this is a man 
This man is sad. He is sad. Uh, you can see that. This house is alone on a hill. You can, you can see that. This alien is far from home. And that's the alien far from home. And then I really like, I really like this, this, um, this face here. Very nice, very nice expression face. Oh, some more, I think, my moss people. We got... Polly and Spoon, and then I drew this drawing <laughs> with the, the tall pencil, just not thinking about anything, and the little pencil's like, murder, and then he pulls out a knife, and he's like, ka -chow! and then he hits, he hits the tall pencil, but he, he doesn't do a lot of damage, so it just gets a <laughs> band-aid, and, <laughs> and then it's just very angry. I think it- I think it was funny, okay? I don't know if you think it's funny. I thought it was funny. Okay, really funny. Ooh, I watched Over the Garden Wall while drawing this, so it's very Over the Garden Wall coded. Um, and we got some, like, stamps and stuff. This one? This- the bird. I can't even remember what the bird's name was. But it's the same bird, so I- I was- I felt really cool when I put that in. And, um, this is a sketch for, like, a paper doll I did, which is right here. Wait, let me show you. This guy. It's really cool. It's, like, stuff with tape and stuff at the bottom. Hmm. Uh, random stuff. Some flowers. <laughs> this page is just slugs are scaries flamingos are demons and then I drew a demon flamingo over here <laughs> and then I watched elemental and I drew the little elemental guys and I'm a big Pixar fan so I love the movie but everyone I talked to they're like eh, it was mid so I don't really know if I'm just biased but I, th I thought it was good it was good and I drew Water Girl and Lava Boy because <laughs> what else am I supposed to draw on this spread? Uh, I also really like the little face I drew down here. Here are some snails. A lot of just snails. And this, and, and then I thought like, what if I was in the elemental universe? I don't know if anyone's drawn that before, but this is me. If I was in the elemental universe, I would be one of the tree guys because I am moss. So that makes, that makes sense, right? Um, so look, this is me if I was in the elemental universe. I would have flowers in my hair because I have like my hair dyed So I thought that would be like a cool way to show that my hair was a different color Now I got this face over here Where I like tried to make her eyes look like they were lighting up, but I'm not sure if that came across um, ooh, We got the spread I don't like her, but whatever. Then we got like a like a, a scene goth owl, <laughs> and uh, I redrew no, very very old artwork here, and I really love the art style I drew her in. Wish I could recreate it, but whatever. And here's just a like a bird with a pink sweater on. And here we got a dog with socks. It's a dog with socks, guys. Wow! <laughs> Should make that, like, that on a t-shirt or something. Dog with socks, and then a dog with a sock on. That would be so cute. Um, red of guy. Some, some random things with Posca pens, you know. I don't know what's happening on this page. Just some random powdering. I was bored, okay? And this is what happens when I'm bored. So, you know, I was bored again. I was probably watching like a YouTube video where someone explains something really complicated and I just listen and draw in the meantime. Yep. Here are some dogs um, from Pinterest. I made a TikTok video with these guys, right? And they're very cute. I really like this demonic one up here and this one. <laughs> the one with the bread and that one. Not really happy with this one. Or there's like a pink pink elf or lady. What do you say? Elf? Elf. It's like an elf. I don't know. And another weird pattern thingy. Which I really like this one. 
I even put some like nail polish on it, glittery, na glittery nail polish, and I'm not sure if you could see it, but in the light it shimmers. Okay, this page is just very, very um, weird, but we got generally worried Sally, and she's thinking about the world exploding. <laughs> very funny. And this is, do you guys, do you guys know this guy? Swedish people know who this guy is. It's um, it's the bear guy. It's the guy who is really strong. Um, so, oh, there's a fish underneath. Um, these are just some Alex doodles, but I don't really like him. And then we got this old man in a suit, and I I just wrote a little a little poem thingy for him. It was the man's seventy seventy seven seventy. 70 birthday. 70 birthday. That is not how you say it. Whatever. He had his favorite suit on. 70 birthdays, 70 favorite suits. I think that's how you say it. 60, 70, 80. Yeah, 70, right? I don't know. Redraw of a very old drawing this little thingy it's just a flower but i really like the way i drew the flower it's cool and here we have my uh my little comic with sally and alex because if you can't tell i was really trying to flesh out alex and sally's character in the sketchbook because i realized i hadn't drawn them at all in my other sketchbook i did before this one so i was like man i have to draw them so here's i'll read it up loud for you here they are in the like in the floaty air balloon that Sally has. Hey, can I ask you a question? <laughs> sure! That's, it's very long, so that means he's saying, sure. Why do you have a, why do you have a plant growing out of your head? It doesn't make any sense. Well, <laughs> it's always been there. Even when I was very little, everyone else said it was a mistake. Failure. That's some, that's one some Alex lore right there. But I love my sprout. So you have no idea why it's there. Nope. But I do know one thing. That it loves me. <laughs> and then we have a little Sally face over here. That's still not an answer. <laughs> it's funny. And uh, don't look at this. I I thought I was gonna do Inktober in my sketchbook, so this was like day one dream, and I drew the YouTuber hit YouTuber dream, but like a person having a nightmare about d dream. But it, I kind of gave up because I also got Inktober as homework from school, so I had to do that instead of Inktober in my sketchbook. So I did that. I decided to to do that instead. Oh my god, when I talk for a very long time, I fumble on my words, so sorry about that. But this is a spider, and it's got like, the eyes are 3D, and it's really nice to touch. Here we got Sally, and this weird goofy guy. He looks like he's from a Ghibli movie or something. <laughs> very funny looking. And just another random pattern thingy, because I do that when I'm bored. It's emoji, I don't know. And a heart human. And here's the heart human. Very cool, very cool. It's because I didn't want it to smudge on the other guys, so that's why I made like a protective wall out of post-its. Got this random thing, and I think my mom, look, my mom made this. My mom's an artist. She is a very, very good at art. So I just put that in there because need to hold on to it. A, B, C, D. <laughs> I don't know. Graffiti art. I don't know. Drew this character. Haley. I like them. Cool cowboy boots. Also like this art style. Um, very cool. Very, very cool. <laughs> My sister said I had to draw a muffin human. Um, so this is what came out of the the, the prompt <laughs> muffin human. <laughs> Very weird looking. Got Sally, we got Alex again, some side port side profiles. 
<laughs> okay, I like this one's cute, but then this one's just messed up. I don't know what happened to Sally's side profile. Um, I really like this little doodle. Um, why am I saying um so much? Just ignore that, please, because th that is something that is just programmed into my DNA. I will just say um whenever. This random character, I don't know. I really like the noses I was drawing at this time. They were like this, like a little boop, boop. good noses. And here's some scrunkly hands and one foot. And it's supposed to say ugly hands, but instead it looks like it says hand ugly. But whatever. Let's get the page. Um oh my god, is it not okay? That is sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Face. Random face. Random person. I don't really know anymore. Uh, here's some here's a little finger. If anyone, if everyone thinks, if anyone thinks I robbed a bank or something, just look at my sketchbook because here are all my fingerprints. Um, I almost said oh my god. I said oh my god. Whatever. Random face. I don't really know what's going on. Sally. I tried to make another comic, but I don't think this one was was uh, as good as the other one. But I'll read it for you anyways. Blue isn't even my favorite color, and she says that because her hair is blue. Really? Yeah. Then what is? I don't know. Orange is nice. And then Alex is like, Alex is like, yeah, it is. And that's that. They just sit in uh, Sally's balloon and talk about deep stuff. That's what they do. That's all I've been planning so far for their story. <laughs> This, uh, got this weird spread. This guy just staring into your soul. Da da da! <laughs> With the gold Pasca. I, I was just, yeah. Right in the face. I really like this little guy over here. He looks like a Yu Gi Oh character or something. <laughs> and then this. You'll see that there are some, like, weird hand thingies. Wait, let me go back. These weird hand thingies. Put in on the pages and it was like a big giant sheet I found that I got for free at a museum and I just put them in and I don't really know what they mean or anything but they're nice to fill space so you know <laughs> um yeah here we have a lady and more of my moss character because I realized I ha I was thinking of redesigning Moss, but I never did. So this is me kind of thinking of how I would redesign them. And then my dad said I had to draw a, a flying car to fill space. I drew this one, which looks really goofy. And then and then my dad said, yeah, make it cooler. So I <laughs> it needs to be 20% cooler. And then I put I put like wings on it, and this is like from birds view like from the from the top yeah and here here look this is kind of the redesign of moss but if you know you know that i did a 30k draw this in your style where i used the moss character and i even redesigned it a little bit more it looks really cool yeah, so it, it ended up not looking like this because I didn't like this because it looked too much like Sally's hairstyle and that was annoying me a lot so I was like, it needs to be different. Random stuff, whatever. Also just random stuff. I really like this face I did with a very, very soft pencil. Applado. <laughs> Uh, then I realized I had to get better at drawing from reference and better at anatomy so looked up some pictures on Pinterest and just drew this guy who fell on a skateboard. <laughs> Looks really funny. And this person like holding their cheek or something. And, and this this person. And there was also this person and this this girl, which was really cool because her hair was all like staticky, so it was like floating around. I posted this on TikTok too, so if you're not following my TikTok for some reason, go follow my TikTok, which is exactly the same name as the YouTube, just on TikTok. 
yeah, whatever. Uh, this sprite, which I actually think came out very well, but this is also a photo from Pinterest of a character. No, not a character, a person, a real person in real life, not a character. And um, another photo of this guy taking a picture with his camera, and then there are two pigeons. Just, I love pigeons. I love pigeons. And then we have um, a random pattern with glitter glue on it because I love glitter glue and I bought some glitter glue. This is also just random stuff. A lot of random stuff. Went to a museum and I drew some sculptures because I am an artist. <laughs> I like this one. This one, I don't know what happened to this one. Oh, we got this lady and a lot of dog sculptures, so I drew the dog sculptures. I, I was not very good at it. Really like that one. And then this one, this dog. <laughs> the dog is watching you. The dog, the dog is watching you. I don't know what this is. Random stuff, random lady. Some tea, call them the, the three tea ladies. They've got like, I don't know, fashion pose. <laughs> Here's some more photos from Pinterest because I need to get better at anatomy. So that and that guy, the star man. Here's some more glitter glue and I got like uh, this one, this, I got a, uh, I don't even know what it's called, but one of these guys and uh, some some ink, and then I made this this lady, which I really like. Just ignore the sounds in the background. I also found some headphones on the ground, so I just took those. Or it was a broken pair of headphones. That's why I took them because if they were working, I would not take them from the ground. But this goblin guy more stamps or whatever and uh face and another face done with the with the blah, the pen. and i really like this one this post stamp or whatever and then i if you watch the tiktok video you watch the tiktok video but the video where i just slam paint everywhere this is how it turned out in the end very dramatic and a lot of glitter glue on it and a lot of glitter too but it was fun sometimes you just gotta splatter paint everywhere and make a mess and then deal with the artwork later and there's a little hole here which is an eye and then you turn it and it's my hand mark <laughs> it's my hand but it's like a weird alien hand and um skeleton christmas chocolates we're getting close to the end now. It's it's actually the end almost. Weird like paper thing that I just colored and uh, face face random things. I don't know what I was doing anymore. Um, this this lady that I actually really like put a lot of layers of watercolor on her and I think she turned out good and moment troll. Ooh, then we have this page, with which is a cool fold-out page. You got this girl, which is also drawn with this one. I don't know. But then you fold it out, and we got... <gasps> you can, can see it, but it's a... It's Miles Morales from the Spider-Man movie. <laughs> I drew him, like, frame to frame and stuff. And then if you fold this out, we got just a little, I just drew another frame to frame thing with the miles falling, falling down and boom batten. Wobble wop wow, wobble wop wow. Very funny, very fun exercise. And then, and then here is just Parvitra. Sorry, but I can't say his name for I 
I can't do it. But here he is just doing the weird thing. And it, it was very low effort, so it's kind of ugly. Here is the almost last page. Got this face, which I actually really like, and these random, um, random star guys. And then the, the last page. Ba -ba -ba -bum. Da -da -da, which I did yesterday or something like that. Um, it's really ugly and I really hate it with all the like, with all my heart. I really hate this, but it's supposed to be like a redraw. the beginning and you you can tell that I got worse <laughs> for some reason my art style got worse or something <laughs> I did not improve in the sketchbook I went down with art skills uh, here's a fish with legs which is always nice and here's the last page we got a self portrait of me 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 and the end and there's just me being angry and saying this took way too long but yeah that's that's it that's that's what it is and i don't know what's in here but i think it's just yeah just some post-it notes and stuff yep that was the sketchbook tour hopefully this is not way too long i'll see when i edit it um Again, don't recommend the sketchbook. As you can see, it's just falling apart here. It's it's not going well. And now when you watch this part, you will see a sneak peek of the next sketchbook. I'm, I'm gonna be, uh, my, my, uh, my sketchbook. Which is this guy. I made him myself. Because it was like a, like a very, very old vintage book. I took all the pages out and I put in new pages. And look at how cool it is. I made the binding myself and everything. And it's like thick watercolor paper because I got really angry at this guy for having so thin paper. So now we have watercolor paper that, paper that will stand anything. And also, I don't think there's that many pages in this because the pages are so thick. So hopefully I'll get this finished way quicker than the other one. But that was it, thank you for watching. Um, if you like the sketchbook tour or you like my art, you can watch my two other sketchbook tours I have done, posted, or you can follow me on TikTok if you don't already do that. Goodbye. <laughs>